epic bonfire blowout for all time. Oh, dude. Fuck yes. I'm in, Nick. You're in. Yeah, I'm in. Dylan's in, obviously. My man. Caitlin? I go where my people need me. Yeah, okay. M, what do you say? Mm. <laughs> yeah, I'm in. Mr. Hackett seemed pretty insistent we stay in the lodge. He was just trying to freak us out, you know? Like, um... Like one of Ryan's stupid ghost stories. Why would he want to scare us? I don't think he was trying to freak us out, Jacob. I think he was really freaked out by something. Jesus Christ. Chris seemed real serious about this, guys. Just say you're in, man. Come on, one last night. Yeah, Dude, he won't even know. I, I promised. I no, 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 D dude, dude. It's all good, all right? We get it, you know? You, uh, you don't want to disappoint daddy. Whatever, man. It's gonna be fine, man. Trust me. It's gonna be chill. All right, all right, all right. Hacketeers, party planning committee. Let's do this. Um, okay. First things first. Nick and Abby, you go get some firewood. Uh, Emma and I will go to the stores for some supplies. And uh, Dylan, you just—I don't know—figure out how to charge the phones for something. All right, let's do this. I was hoping you'd come back to me. Let's see what you've found. Temperance. <laughs> to be balanced. To consume in moderation. Or to indulge in excess. Temperance. Take it or leave it. But remember, sometimes... With temperance comes deferred gratification. There's more I can show you, if you like. Fine. Fine. You'd better be going. It's still early and the moon is bright, but time won't wait. Not for those with a story to tell. Be careful. Look out for yourselves. And look out for my cards.
So here we are, stranded in the great American wild with nothing but our wits to guide us. Will humanity prevail or will we grow ravenous and resort to eating the flesh of the deceased like I saw in that one plane crash movie? Hm. First course, filet au Jacob. Rich and full-bodied, this rare beefcake may leave an irritating taste lingering on the palate. And a fire taste, some would say. Wow. Well. What? Looks like you're trying to thread a needle with a packet of loose sausages. Oh my god, I'm almost done, okay? Jesus Christ. And for the record, your analogies are very hurtful. Okay, I'm almost there. One second. Yeah! Whoa! And scene. Oh, I mean, I could have kicked it. You loosened it for me. Okay. So, if I were a beer, where would I be hiding? Beep! What Beep. are you doing? Beep. Oh, <laughs> uh, it's my beer dar. Helps me dar for beers. Huh. How am I just noticing how super lame you are? What? But it, it's my beer dar, dude. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna go over here. Wow, the kids really wiped this place out. Mr. H loved his accessories. Hm. Think it's locked. Don't know what I was expecting. Oh. Oh, hell yeah! <laughs> oh! Jackpot! Hey, uh, check out my giant melons. Oh. See, you just cut a hole in it. Mm hmm. You pour in your vodka. It's party time. You just, you pour the vodka right in it. Yeah, it's the most fun you could have with a hole in watermelon. Or, well, second most. Okay, I'm gonna leave you two alone and go look for some more party supplies. I wonder where this goes. Locked. Jacob! Come check this out. Oh, uh, alrighty then. Door, buckle up because you are about to meet your maker. Done. Nice. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. The fucking mother love. Good golly, Miss Molly. I wonder I kept this place locked up. <laughs> 